Religious leaders under the Dialogue Reference Group have held consultations with the IBC in addressing gaps and concerns on the preparedness of the upcoming August polls. According to IBC Chairman Mafula Chebukashi, the Commission has adequately prepared for the upcoming polls, but religious leaders and other stakeholders should help ensure free, fair and peaceful elections. As Tess Njenga now reports, the meeting bore a 10-point agreement to aid in the streamlining of the election process. In a bid to ensure adequate election preparedness in the upcoming polls, members of a dialogue reference group from different religious organizations on Tuesday held a meeting with the IABC chairman Wafula Chebukati. The parties have settled on a 10-point agenda that both will work on to ensure credible polls come August 9th. We roll out a national prayer at the national and the subnational levels dedicated to peaceful free and fair and transparent elections. Number two, we have agreed to commit and give moral support and encouragement to the Commission as it, it undertakes this national exercise. Number three, we shall commence interaction with Kenyans in our places of prayer and worship to strengthen interaction with stakeholders so that we educate our voters as we gear towards the next election. IEBC Chairman Wafula Chebukati told the religious leaders that his commission has adequately prepared for the upcoming polls but requires our stakeholders' support. We are prepared up to the level of our election operation plan, which then has timelines to the 9th of August. So, uh, as at the moment, uh, we embarked on the uploading the voter register, the new voters and the transfers, which should be completed in a couple of days. After that, we shall, uh, at the same time, we're also carrying out the duplication, removing the multiple uh, registration. After that, we shall subject the register to audit. Uh, already, we have procured an audit firm that will undertake the exercise. And of course, you are aware that uh, political parties will be doing their uh, primaries. So we are actually where we are supposed to be. On voter confidence in the electoral process question, the IABC chair said Kenyans have confidence in the institution's ability to conduct free and fair elections. From what I know, Kenyans are really looking forward to 9th of August. And the ones I meet in the streets, uh, they are happy with what the commission is doing so far. So I, I believe uh, we have to work this journey together and uh, with our engagements. And we had a media uh, sector working group. We had an MOU on how to disseminate information to Kenyans and uh, uh, make them then believe in the process. I think if we work together, all of us, including the religious leaders, we can uh, have a successful, free, fair, credible and peaceful election. With about five months remaining to the general elections, Chabukati says plans are underway for further civic education, though he decries a deficit in budgetary allocation. As a commission, we only got the election budget this year, and we've done what we can within the framework of that budget, although we have uh, uh, some, uh, some deficit. I think we did what we could within the, the budget we had. So that's why we are here. We are appealing to our stakeholders, and uh, to, 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 uh, we can't do this on our own. Uh, we are appealing to stakeholders or to support us where you can on uh, matters of civic education. For Hope TV News Watch, I'm Tess Jenga.